Welcome to the first episode of JavaScript for You. This morning what we're going to start doing, by we I mean me as well, is learn JavaScript. To get started what you need is a standard text editor. I'm using text edit on the Mac and the first thing you want to know is you have to go into preferences and make sure you're doing plain text. If you're editing code files you don't want to be using rich text so you change this over. And that'll work the same way with any text editor you're using. There are better text editors for writing code. We're going to start simple. Now, to write JavaScript, what you need to do really is probably be working with the web, and you're going to then need an HTML document. So you put a standard HTML header out here, and to put any JavaScript in, you need a script tag. This is how your web page knows that you're working with a script, and you tell it, I'm working with a script of type text JavaScript. Every browser in the universe will understand that. For the handful that don't, or for customized applications that maybe use an embedded browser that doesn't, you want to comment out any JavaScript, and you do that by putting this beginning tag, and this ending tag. In general, slash slash is JavaScript for comment, and that will prevent a browser from pushing this out as plain text if it doesn't understand JavaScript. Now this JavaScript right here, it's very basic. It just writes hello world out there. I'm going to save this as hello.html. The .html is important because I want this to be an HTML file. And I'm going to tell my text editor to use HTML. Now all I really need to do is go to my browser, file, open file, and I'm going to go into the same directory I had, JS Lessons. And I'm going to open up hello.html. And there it is. Not very exciting, but you've written your first JavaScript piece of code and gotten it working in a browser. We'll move on from here. So until next time, have fun with JavaScript.